Hello to everyone. My name is NC Lightworker and welcome to the Black Off Grid YouTube channel. This video is part of the Real Talk video series where we are going to discuss issues as it relates to homesteading, prepping, and self-reliance before, during, and after a catastrophic event. I have a second YouTube channel under the name of NC Lightworker that will give you insight into my personal views and outlook regarding the future. I do not respond to questions, comments, or emails because as a lightworker, I am only here to present the information. The purpose of this video is to create an open forum for like-minded people. If you haven't done so already, please be sure to post your location in the intro video to this channel. Thank you for tuning in, and let's get started. As outlined in the Inside the Matrix video series on my NC Lightworker YouTube channel, when it comes to SHTF, my personal definition of it will be in the form of a global collapse that I suspect will occur in the year 2023. Now everyone's opinion about what it is going to be may vary. Some believe that it is going to be in the form of the next Great Depression where America will eventually recover. Some may believe that it is going to be World War III or either some type of natural disaster. Regardless of what you think it is going to be, we all have one thing in common. We see it coming before the masses do. Wars and economic collapses do not happen overnight. There are always telltale signs. We see the smoke, which explains why you are on YouTube watching videos about homesteading and prepping. However, the average person will not come into realization of the current state of the world until they see the fire. Things have to be obviously bad before people start waking up. Essentially, we have a head start in all of this. So what implication does this have as it relates to your survival? Land ownership is key to survival. I like to think in terms of scenarios and also in terms of cause and effect. So let's just play with some scenarios here. Most people view the stock market as an indicator of stability. So let's assume that the stock market has crashed and the country is now in the beginning phases of a depression. For most people, this will be the second major economic slowdown that they have experienced in their lifetime. This reason alone is going to cause a lot of people to wake up. And when this happens, they're going to be seeking information, looking for alternatives. And guess what? They are going to be on YouTube watching videos about homesteading, prepping, and self-reliance. Basically, there is going to be a huge surge of people looking to establish a homestead. Supply and demand. This is going to affect the cost of land and the availability of land. 
the cost of land is going to go through the roof to where the average person will no longer be able to afford it. I urge you to please purchase a piece of land in a rural area before it becomes obvious. You can do a lot with just half an acre of land. Of course, it is essential that you do your research before you make the purchase. Again, land ownership is key to survival. I am a conscious person, so all this means is that I have a heightened sense of awareness and I tend to view things differently from most people. The state of the world is obvious and has been so for quite some time. It's obvious every time I go to the grocery store. It was very obvious during the last presidential election. Sadly, it is obvious when I look at the youth of today how they live their lives through technology. Cell phones have taken precedence over human interaction. The Most High God created the earth, therefore it can never be destroyed. However, the world as we know it is indeed coming to an end to make way for renewal. This is something that we all need to prepare for. Hope to see you on the other side. The beautiful thing about consciousness is that it will never force itself on you. You always have the option of going back to sleep at any time. The choice is yours. If the information in this post was able to wake up a handful of people, then my mission was accomplished. It is now your responsibility to stay awake, prepare, and continue connecting those dots. Please feel free to share this post. God bless and take care.